Holy cow. Heck yeah. So for the bait that I'll be using, I'll be using frozen mussels. So this is just uh, mussels from the store. The, the eels really love this stuff. Anything stinky. So here's the final product. So the concept behind it is um, you want a real sturdy hook because these eels are so strong they can uh, straighten out any regular hooks. You gotta use something that's really, really thick. Same with the line. They can snap most line. I'd recommend using uh, a heavy pound test line or, or some nylon rope, 550 cord works. Swivels are good because these eels can snap your line because they just tend to do the death roll and just spin out so yeah and I don't recommend using too uh, skinny of a rope because um, when that eel starts tugging he can shred your hand up so so I put a little grip here just to kind of like gain more control of the rope when he starts going crazy yeah so the concept is I'm gonna go in there put the bait on this and you can get real close to the eel and he won't mind and you just get the bait and the, you dangle it in front of his face. And when he bites, I'm gonna yank him up and just try to get him in this bucket as soon as possible because if he gets off my hook, he'll escape. They can crawl on land pretty good. So yeah, that's, uh, that's the plan of action. All we gotta do is try it out and see if we catch him. Oh yeah. So I'm here at the river, and these eels like really shallow water. You'll find them under rocks and stuff, so I found them. Let's go see if you guys can see it. He's looking for the bait. Who wants it? Okay.
Holy shit. He's in there. We got him. We got him. Holy cow. Heck yeah.